Hello everybody, welcome back to some more Spelunky 2 modded. Today we're going to be trying out a very special mod where everything I do instant restarts. <laughs> so the bomb jump and rope key will instant restart if uh, pressed while moving. So you can jump and move. Okay, so if you do that, if you hold it and then you jump, wait, I just did it. What happened there? Wait, what reset me? If you jump off a ladder, that reset? <laughs> okay, this might uh, break, break me. At least like if I, if I'm going down, it's not too bad. But, um, so jumping while moving resets, bombing while moving, roping while moving. Oh my gosh, even if, <laughs> even if you're in the air, I thought you'd be safe in the air. Okay. And whip, uh, you can whip while in the air and while you're moving. So at least that's the same. I'm gonna see if I can beat the game with this on. Um, this is not looking like a great start. <laughs> oh yeah, that's right, I pressed jump. Oh my gosh. Wait, can I not drop off ladders? Because it's jumping, I guess? Okay, that's interesting. I can drop down. Oh my gosh, you can't ledge grab. Wait. If you drop down from a ledge grab, that also counts as moving. Oh my... <laughs> well, this is gonna be something. Oh my gosh, dude. I, I literally just talked about how that was a thing. Alright, we cleared another level. Oh, Quillback's gonna be really hard now that I think about it. Olmec? I think is easy still. I'm not going Sunken City with this though. I do not want to do the, the hunt on fight with this one. Wait, does that mean that I can't jetpack? I'm not sure. Oh my gosh! I thought if you're on a wall, it wouldn't make a difference because it's not like you're going forward, but it's just, okay, it's that strict. Uh-oh. <laughs> I remembered, let's go. That's a, a big improvement. Remembering things is... Okay. So if you move while jumping, it resets. Oh my gosh, that was really dangerous. Um... Okay, so if you just jump while holding neutral, it's fine. And you can drop through platforms. I almost dropped down, which would have reset the game. <laughs> oh, a tide pool is going to be really hard. I just... Yeah, a tide pool is going to be really hard. So such an interesting challenge. Because the, uh, the bomb and rope stuff, that's fine. But not being able to run and jump is... It makes it very difficult. Okay. <laughs> I played that very carefully. And I made it through.
I'm really glad you can whip while moving, because if you couldn't whip while moving, this would actually be really hard. Oh wait, does this work? Yeah! <laughs> so you can drop down if there's uh, one of those. And you can also do Tiamat normally because, um, I almost just dropped down. So I can drop down bombs. That's the only way I can use bombs. Oh my gosh, it's still so scary when you're doing, like, normal platforming. Back to the slimy looking game, yes. So every time I jump while moving, it instant restarts. That's the mod that I'm playing. Also, bombing and roping. But that's not as annoying. Why? Now there's a question. This might be the first uh, speedrun ever done with this mod on. Oh my, I pressed A to skip the cutscene. I was so worried I would jump by accident. Garfield makes me happy. <laughs> nice. <laughs> oh yeah, I forgot to add some of your uh, commands from the, the drunk night you had in Discord. Uh-oh. Okay, that works. I'm so glad you can drop through ladders, otherwise I would have had to bomb there, I think. Water is the scariest one, because you can jump in water. This this was not meant to come off as, like, <laughs> the way that I said that. Wait, I don't think I can throw this rock either. Oh, I almost reset there. That was so scary. Oh my gosh, dude. Oh my gosh. This is like the scariest mod, but it just looks like I'm being bad. Kinda funny. GAME! 
No! <laughs> I was holding up when I jumped. I think that resets it. Because I was going to grab the rope. I never would have thought the mechanic where you can't rope from a ledge grab would kill me, but here we are. Man, that... that Zhang... not Zhangxi, that Pangxi was in such a bad spot. Oh my gosh. Keep forgetting you can't do that. So when you uh, ledge drop, you're technically holding down an A, which counts as holding a direction. Even though you can drop off platforms and you would think that they would work the same way, but I guess not. I almost just did it again. I almost just did it again. <laughs> ah, this mod. Hopefully it's at least entertaining. <laughs> The same way walk percent is. Okay, so that doesn't count as a reset either. Oh my! I almost just did it again. Alright. Alright, just whip past ledges and then it doesn't hurt as much. I think I'm gonna kill Quillback this time. I'm done doing the slow percent. I really want those extra bombs. Because the game is being mean to me. Oh, hello, bombs. Probably should have bought ropes instead of two bombs, but whatever. Alright, never ledge grab. If you don't ledge grab, then you can't ledge grab. Simple economics. I almost ledge grabbed. This is so sad. I just realized I could have I could have set up a um I could have set up an input display for this. I don't know how though. No coolback bombs, unfortunate. Uh, I guess I could pause the recording and see if I could, um... Alright, I just looked up on the internet and there's this. Um, seems to be working. So, uh, let me know if this looks good. I could potentially, uh, just keep it on. That was pretty scary with the uh, falling platforms. Oh, I didn't need a bomb. Whoops. Yeah, so if I'm holding right and I press jump, uh, it resets. 
But if I'm holding nothing, if I'm in neutral, I'm fine. This kind of feels like a horror mod because it's so scary. And jumping off enemies is fine, even though you press jump in midair. This is a cool input display though. Maybe I'll uh, keep using it. Let me know in the comments if you're uh, liking it or not. What do you think, Carl? I remembered. I bet you guys were scared. You didn't listen, but the control looks fine. Nice. Carl, do you ever listen? Okay, so whipping and jumping works. Neat. You said no, but you saying that means that you listened to me asking the question. Oh gosh, that jump. That jump is scary in the best of times. No! I had to drop down. There's a Zhang Shi there. Rip. So yeah, you're holding down when you drop off that, so it's a reset. Also, if you drop off a ladder. Um, and if you bomb, and if you rope. Even if you're midair. <laughs> it's cool. <laughs> what a great mod you made. I almost dropped. Ladders become like the scariest part of this game with this mod. Also ledge grabs. No! I wasn't standing still when I did the bomb. Right, okay. I thought I got trolled, but I did know that rule. I just forgot it in the moment. Because I'm used to uh, it only mattering when I have to jump. Jetpack? No, that, that just makes things way harder. Wow, that lizard got destroyed. Absolutely destroyed.
Nice. Whoops, that was almost scary. I mean, it was scary, but almost scarier, I guess. Oh, hey, spike ball above the drill. That's like two bombs to get through, I think. I didn't die there. Wait. I think I broke the rules, but I was in an iframe, so it didn't count. That's interesting. Oh, come on! The game forced me into a ledge grab, and then I acted before my brain could think. Wow. Bruh, I was, I was so thinking about, like, not dropping from the ledge that I didn't think about my next move, and I just did that. Wow, this is actually, like, impossible. Funny thing is how team out like barely changes. But it's just getting there is ridiculous. Hello, that novel you working on. How's it going? Gaming is going good. You spelled it wrong. Gaming. Ah, oh, this mod. I should probably put the mod name in the title. Uh, what is this mod called again? Let's see. The It's a Guy mod. That is a wordy title. The It's a Guy mod, bomb rope and jump while moving equals instant restart. You're on vacation? Wait, why is the control thing not working? Does it only work when like, when it's on screen? This is very weird. I think it only works when it's on screen. That's really annoying. There it goes. Yeah, it just stops working if you uh, have Twitch chat over it. That's fun. This is probably why people like download downloadable things instead. I can't bomb around. That worked. That was a very scary maneuver.
there we go. That A press is still so scary. <laughs> I guess I don't have to be holding right while I press it. But you have to press A to skip that all night cutscene. Olmec is not too different aside from the push block part. I see you. That was- what? No way that was fall damage. I do not understand this game. Alright. No. Wow, I almost got killed by that. Nice. Okay. <laughs> Destroyed. I just can't ledge grab. Well, I can, but I can't ledge drop. Oh, that was close. I thought I was going to instant restart there. No! That counted! Okay. Rough. I don't know how you do that. I guess you could go neutral midair and then rope. Oh man. I just get so used to the, the movement ones that I forget about. No! <laughs> I thought that was going to be my free ride. I could just jump and teleport down and I wouldn't have to worry about getting around. But no. That would be too easy, I guess. Um, okay. I buffered a jump while moving left there, but it didn't kill me. That's interesting. Whoa, why did that- Wait, did I just reset- how- did I just reset and transition? What? Have I accidentally done that before, maybe? That might explain why some of these dwellings have been so long. <laughs> Whoops. Um... Wait, I'm curious. I'm gonna try... In the next transition, I'm going to try to input uh, something that will kill me. Oh my gosh, it does. Okay. That's really annoying. <laughs> I don't know why you would make it like that, Jay. That is very cruel. Cruel and unusual punishment. I don't know if this mod was ever meant to be beaten. But I'm gonna keep going. Not to Sunken City though. I don't want to fight Kingu with this on. 
or Osiris, or Hundun. This is an AG seed, and I got it while I have this script on. It is kind of making me appreciate how levels have uh, ways where you don't have to use the platforms. Wow, that didn't trigger the arrow. That's kind of wacky. Maybe I shouldn't be doing Volcana because the, the fallen platforms make this so much harder. I don't think it matters too much though. Bruh, are you kidding me? That whip just fucking whiffed right next to its face. I mean, okay game. This is gonna throw off my muscle memory when I go back to playing the normal game. What happens if you double jump in midair? Oh, it counts! No! I shouldn't have landed on that turkey. I thought it would be a shortcut, but instead it was just a blocked off uh, part of the level. Unlucky. You have to hold a direction because you can't ledge grab while you're on a turkey. So getting a mount is just a detriment completely. That I can drop off of. I had to wait for the bat to free me of the ledge grab curse. This is kind of similar to Pacifist, like almost. Maybe I should have used a bomb there. some progress here. Nice. Nice. I was fast enough to where the chain didn't retract. Would have been much harder. Thank you, Chain Ball, for being based. Nice. 
Nice. Nice. <laughs> no! I pressed it one too many times because it ate the first input because of the loading zone. Oh my gosh. That was a very dumb way to die. Got him. That was kind of clean, getting that mole out of the air. Why? You know, there's an easier way to reset there. <laughs> I was thinking, like, a mod that would make it so that instant restart was one button press would be great for speedrunning. And this mod is made where everything is instant restart. Your stuff is too expensive, my friend. That worked. Nice. We're making it pretty far, which is good. You know what you could also do? You could make a mod that makes it so that if you press right or left for more than two seconds, it instant restarts. So you'd have to like stutter step. Ah, oh, that sounds very cruel. There we go. That was a really hard one. Oh boy. Really a risky maneuver there. Okay, that was good. That was one A press to skip the cutscene. Might be worth it to watch. To watch the cutscene, I don't know. Not a great time for a skeleton to spawn there.
I'm on vacation trying to call him. All of my coins I spent on you. Oh boy, my favorite part of the game. Waiting for Crabman to die. Fun crab fact, crabs are allergic to spears. I also don't like to stand still in front of them. Gosh, you'd live that, huh? That's fun. Wow, it spawned on path. Wow, I just had to not do that. I would have been fine. Cool level. I only just hit the glow button on my Xbox controller. I don't know if that uh, shows up on the overlay. But I turned it right back off, so you didn't miss out on much. Oh gosh, that was so much scarier than normal. Don't like that area. <laughs> it's kind of fun. Wait. Oh, it works if you're midair, so it would kill you with jetpack. And telepack. Wait, you can't use telepack. That's hilarious. <laughs> telepack becomes unusable. Unless, I guess, if it's, like, straight ahead. Oh, I have to do the ice caves drop again. That'll be interesting. You know, all of Nate wants to battle's uh, Pokemon parody songs have their weirdness, but I can't stop thinking about that line. 
where he goes, if being Pokemon Master did exist, I would not be getting owned like this. Because, like, bro, you don't just get to be Pokemon Master immediately in Pokemon. That's, like, not the point of the games. You just pick it up in your Pokemon Master already. You have to work for it. You know? Piss me off. I wonder if Nate wants to battle made his parody songs around Spelunky 2 like I did instead of Pokemon, would he still have gotten as famous? Oh, that was really dangerous actually. I almost pressed A there. never really notice just how many times you jump until you play a mod like this. I got that jump. <laughs> I keep saying I should wait the cutscene because it's so much more dangerous. Because I'm so used to spamming jump at the start. But it works most of the time, so there's that. Oh, I sailed under that. Okay, it's kind of nifty. Doggy rescue. I repeat, doggy rescue. Gotta know when to hold them. Know when to fold them. Know when to walk away. What? What did I do? I don't want to be back here, game. Put me back there. Man. Eric, please buff ladder speed. It is so slow. Like, it's ridiculously slow. But it doesn't matter most of the time because you can just fan jump. But it is annoying when you do have to climb ladders because Quillback aggroes when you don't expect him to. So jetpacks are actually worthless. So are telepacks. Wow. 
How does it work if you're like jetpacking and then you um use it again in midair that kills you? But what if you use it while you're holding neutral, then you hold on to it and then you start moving? Will that instant restart you? Oh, I expected him to still be alive down there somehow. But hey, we're up a bomb from last run. I was a little bit worried I'd get stuck in that spot, but I ended up okay. Oh man. Oh my cutscene is a scary time. No, doggio. All right, actually decent four three for once. Those spikes, though. That was a little bit of a jump scare there. Probably didn't need to carry a mine with me for that. That added a little bit of fear.
I love waiting on lasers, it's my favorite hobby. Thank you, funny alien. Very cool. Oh, I could've used the UFO, whoops. Uh oh. That was lucky. Holy hell. cycle here. I shouldn't have gone down here. I was so close. I was off by a pixel of getting the jump. <laughs> Bruh. I'll count that as a win. <laughs> that was so unlucky. That looked right, but it wasn't the jump. And then I had to reposition. Whatever. Hopefully you guys watch and had some fun at least. That was a fun one. Oh, I can throw bombs down, can I? But not while moving. Man, I was just... Yeah, I was underwater. Man. It's so weird that you could jump and, like, even if it's in midair, it counts as a reset. It makes water just the scariest thing ever. But anyways, that's going to do it for now. If you enjoyed uh, this episode of Modded Spelunky 2, leave a like, comment, subscribe, and I will see you on the next one. Peace out. Oh, check out the stream too.